Hello everyone, thank you for joining us here on TejanoKeyboard.com or for those of you on YouTube, Tejano Keyboard uh, YouTube channel. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you for uh, checking out the blog and all the resources we have available. I want to send a shout out going out to uh, Victor Hugo Luna who uh, sent a request for uh, a specific song. I wanted to see uh, a a tutorial on it. Uh, I'm going to do the harmony section for a uh, classic J. Pettis song called Lo Que Yo Tengo off of the uh, the voice album. Um, older tune, very good tune, um, harmony-wise and, and all that. It's a fun tune to play. Um, it's pretty simple. Uh, a lot of people uh, would consider this song to be in D minor, which is uh, correct. I like to think of everything in their relative major key, so to me... Uh, I think of this as F, you know, uh, one flat with a few accidentals. Um, the uh, song is pretty basic uh, in the sense that uh, the uh, harmony is a series of twos and fives, uh, two, five, one chord progressions. Um, uh, those intervals are present in the tune uh, quite often, okay? So let's break down uh, the intro. Uh, uh, I'll play this song a little bit later, but uh, just for now, I mean, most of us already know how the how the tune goes. But uh, the build ups in A dominant, right? D minor, G minor, right? Five. So this is two five. That's uh, your C. Okay. Da, 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 F. Okay. Then you just walk up G minor, A minor, B major seventh. Okay. Then uh, you can do an E half diminished. Um, what also works nicely is this voicing. Okay. Followed by just a building up of the A. Ba, da, 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 da. That's an A major dominant, I guess. Right? Because it's the five to D minor, but we're not gonna go there. It just builds up da 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 and then the five to to F right and then F Okay. So just to review da 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 D minor G minor C dominant F major, G minor, A minor, B flat major, oops, uh, E half diminished, and then A, da 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 uh, then the five chord, uh -oh. and that F chord, you can make it like a sus, you know, you can do, uh, let's see, um, you know that sort of voicing. Okay, so da 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 da. Amo. Okay. Uh, let's see. We're in F, right? And then this is um an a D flat. Major third, fifth, dominant seventh. Okay. Uh, like a diminished up here, fully diminished. G minor. Okay, and then C dominant. And then again, two, five, one. Okay, that's just G minor, C uh, dominant, F. And then there's. Okay, all that is is uh, F major ninth. So you have your uh, five, then five, six, uh, dominant seventh, the octave, and then the uh, third. Sorry, that's a major seventh. What am I saying? Major ninth. And then E, uh, fully diminished. Which is the same as um, right. They just keep repeating. Okay. So.
So uh, once again, and then this is uh, D minor ninth. Okay, here's the seventh, the ninth, the minor third, and the fifth. That one's the ninth. It's a minor ninth. Okay, and then this minor becomes like a kind of diminished uh, chord up here, right? But what that really breaks down to is a flat nine dominant flat ninth because you got your uh, seventh your ninth goes there and then this is the major third and the fifth okay so um, jamás olvidarme de tu corazón okay and then that goes to the G minor A dominant D minor and then it just does a quick 2-5-1 to F and that leads you back to the verse again, okay? Now, the difference between the first verse and the second verse is when it goes, Jamás olvidarme de tu corazón y volver a amarte así. You stay in the D instead of doing the 2 5 1, and then it goes to the A. And then the um, chorus is almost identical to the uh, intro. Excuse my singing, right? And then A. Again. A. Okay. That's basically it. And then at the end, you just... So, here it is with the tune. And we're going to F. Walk up from G to B flat. E half diminished. A. Okay, five. One. D. G minor. C dominant, and then two, five, one, and then walk. And then uh, flat nine, G minor, A major. Okay, or dominant, D minor, two, five, one to F. Okay, again to D, G minor, five, two, five. Okay, and then uh, G minor, A dominant, then to D, back to the A dominant, just like the intro, G minor, uh, that's five, this is one, then B flat, E half diminished, A, and then D minor, repeat, okay, then there's a stop. G minor, two, five, one, then walk up to B flat, E half diminished, A dominant, D minor. That's it, okay? So I hope you guys uh, enjoyed that tune. Um, there's different versions of it live too. Uh, there's, they do some really cool stuff live, but um, you know, as far as the studio version, that's pretty much the uh, meat and potatoes of it. Um, if you guys have any other questions in regard to this song or any other songs or videos on uh, my website or the YouTube channel, be sure to hit me up on the handle keyboard at gmail.com. Um, also, feel free to contact me on the website. There's a little form you can fill out and uh, let me know that you're uh, watching the video. So once again, a shout out going out to uh, my friend, uh, Victor Hugo Luna, who specifically wanted to hear the song. Thank you very much. And I hope you guys have a good day and keep practicing until next time.